I've got an original recipe for you guys today. This one's called the stray cat. You gotta watch it all the way to the end and find out why I call this recipe the stray cat. A dozen eggs from a chicken. Let's put them in the water. So these eggs, they've been cooking for about 10 minutes. We're gonna go ahead and take them off the stove and put them on an ice bath. Pour some water in there. Let them cool down. So when I was younger, when I was in elementary school, on Easter, we would have an Easter egg hunt at school. And we hunted boiled eggs. And we all ate them. So they don't do that no more. Not that I know of. But you know, I think the reason why they don't do it no more is because there was some god awful farts in that school. Probably just made everybody sick. A lot of people use uh, tools, potato mashers, whatever the case is. Just use your hands. Just take them, brush them up. Duke's mayo. Salt. Calabrian chili pepper. Yellow mustard. And I mix it up. Tastes good. It's not too much salt. You don't really want this to be overpowering. It's supposed to be a really light sandwich. And I, I do like this, the spiciness in it. So those Calabrian chili peppers make it really, really nice. The type of bread that I'm gonna use today, it's gonna be a, like a barbecue bread. You can find this at your grocery store. These cuts in it. You want them to be straight. Sometimes they're diagonal, so you have a really thin piece of bread. So look at the bread, make sure it's cut straight. Tear it off. So we're gonna right down the center, take your knife sideways. So you wanna cut it before it's like a hot dog bun. Then we're gonna grill each side and we're gonna stuff it full of that beautiful deviled egg mixture. this on medium low heat put them in there let them cook slow looks good let's go ahead and flip them I'm gonna put some more chili pepper right inside here deviled egg baby I want to add some more stuff to it though. Let's do some bacon and maybe some pickle. It's got this little stuck up attitude on it. It just looks like it's sophisticated. You know what I like about it? It's just really, it's really simple. It doesn't take you but a few minutes to make this thing. It's easy to eat. You got your two great components in there. Deviled egg and almost like a grilled cheese. There's no cheese, but you could add cheese. Let's, uh, let's go in for a nice bite. Me and my wife were just having a conversation about how we love deviled eggs. We just came up with this idea the other day. What a great idea. You need to try it. What a light sandwich, especially on Sunday. And that Calabria chili pepper, I know I use that in a lot of different uh, things, a lot of different recipes. 
But my goodness, you talking about flavorful. You better be eating this thing on a windy day because you're going to be farting like a stray cat after you eat this bad boy. <laughs>